Hi everyone. So I'm back um, right now just doing a video of a couple things I've purchased um, recently to kind of kick back this weight loss thing. And it's not like I totally gave up. Like I was still eating healthy, but I was making bad food choices, especially at night when I was coming home from work. At work all day, I was making the right choices, drinking my water, um, eating my healthy lunches. And then I got home, which is the worst because I got home late at night. And that's when I would binge out on food um, so if you didn't see my last video look at it and it'll kind of go into more um, explanation as to what happened and why I was binging out and stuff but again no excuses so don't make excuses for yourself um, one thing the reason why I wanted to share that was because I said I was gonna be transparent um, this weight loss journey is not easy um, if it's easy for you guys great um, keep going good job but for I'm pretty sure for most of us that really really struggle with late weight loss it's not easy um, and you do have downfalls and this was my downfall um, but I think the best thing is you can just get up from it and keep going so really learn from my mistakes and that's why I'm sharing it with you guys I'm sorry if I let people down I'm sorry if I let you down um, I know there's a couple of you guys that have been messaging me saying you really follow me um, because you're starting your weight loss journey and um, you really follow for my tips and stuff. So I'm really sorry if I let you guys down, but um, this is why I'm sharing it with you guys so you can learn from my mistakes. If you're on the verge of giving up, don't because you're going to feel like me and it's not good. And I can tell you right now, I just went downstairs to get some things that I'm going to show you. I came up and I was out of breath not the best feeling I almost cried so um, yeah don't do that so one thing I'm going to share with you is um, the tea so you know what me like I I've been pretty um, upfront I don't spend a lot of money on eating healthy I it's not like I'm the richest person on earth that I can go and buy all these um, things that help you lose weight quickly or buy these plans or anything like that um, I'm just trying to do it the affordable way the healthy way so one thing I know you can get this at the store like at Walmart um, in like bulk but I haven't found a green tea that I like I tried Lipton um, and maybe some of you guys like it I just didn't like it um, so the one thing that I said is I eat drink a lot of green tea from Tim Hortons and I'm usually spending like I don't know a dollar fifty for a large I think that's the price um, but then you can buy their um, their box they sell it in a box and it's I think it's like three bucks and you get 20 so hello might as well just buy this and make it yourself um, and not pay a dollar fifty for each one if you can get a box of twenty for three. So this is what it looks like. Um, and what I do is, I don't know why it's very bright, but anyways, um, what I do is I use a tea bag and I keep reusing it. So I'll put the hot water in. I don't throw the tea bag out. I drink my tea. I'll put more hot water in. Um, keep reusing it because it still has flavor, um, and that way you don't run out of your twenty really fast. So this is something you can get. Um, I've heard Tetley green tea is good as well um, and a good taste. So I don't know. I just haven't bought that one yet. I bought two boxes of this. Well, actually, I bought a box and I didn't tell my husband I had done that. I just forgot. So then the same day he went and bought me a box. So now I have two, which is great. So try to do. Um, yeah, try to buy that. Um, and then I have this is just I don't know just a quick tip um, for snacks I I've kind of, I was kind of like running out of snacks and like I told you guys I don't eat carrots every day I get bored so I try to mix it up um, I don't know why I didn't think of this before like just these little oranges I think they're called mandarins or whatever um, try to get these these are so delicious and for me I get the seedless they're a great thing you can just throw in your purse and then have at work um, as a quick snack um, so yeah get some of these they're really delicious they're sweet too um, and it's good so it kind of will like kick you over till your next meal um, so yeah so I get these I have like maybe two even three um, for a snack so that's that um, I thought something fell, but I just started this um, my mom actually showed me these 
they're really good it's high in fiber um, so it's something that I was really looking for was something high in fiber um, and I think this is gluten free too so it won't bloat me um, I find like I don't know like certain things I eat I feel very bloated um, so I've heard that gluten free like shouldn't do that so I don't know I thought I'd try it so it's this anyways um, Mary's organic crackers so I got this at Costco and this was just 10 bucks and it's a huge box um, so it's this one so see what it looks like it's organic Mary crackers original um, and calories aren't high um, that's something I kind of look always is just the calories um, the carbs as well, but I mean again, I don't pay too much attention and I don't count my calories either I just kind of like glance at it um, Just to see so this is what it looks like I'm gonna be really honest with you guys. It's not like the best chips or crackers in the world um, I kind of like getting stuff with flavor that makes me feel like I'm eating um, like regular chips or really really good crackers um, but these are just meh, like, they're healthy so that's why they taste like meh um, so that's what they look like they're just very like a lot of um, I don't know seed, seed thingies um, what does it have it has um, organic whole grain brown rice organic whole grain quinoa um, quinoa is really good. I'm going to show you something else that I bought about quinoa. Organic brown flax seed, organic brown sesame seed, filtered water, sea salt, organic wheat free tamari, water whole organic soybean salt, organic alcohol, or organic vinegar. Nothing in this I could not pronounce. So it doesn't have any crazy ingredients that I'm like, ugh, I don't know what that is. Um, so yeah, so it's really healthy. I just take a little, whoa! I just take a little, sorry Coco, I just scared my dog. I just take a little bake, um, fill these up, and then that's what I eat. I'm going to have one because I haven't had breakfast yet. So, they're good. One thing about this, sorry I'm eating, talking with my mouth full. It makes you really thirsty, which is good because then you'll drink your water. It's actually good. I shouldn't have said they were bad. They actually taste good. You know why? You know why I thought they didn't have flavor? Because I was eating all that junk food these past couple weeks. And this, like, tasted yucky compared to all that junk. But they're actually really good. So I would highly recommend these. Um, just as a snack to get you through a day in a time fiber. So One other thing I got was, um, again, at Costco. Actually, my mom picked it up for me, but it's so delicious, you guys. Hopefully, it doesn't fall. It's um, quinoa salad. So, this is what it looks like. I don't know if it looks appetizing right now because, ah, I think some are falling. Um, but it's so delicious. I, I took a picture of it in a plate with what I had for lunch. I'll post that up um, on Facebook and on Instagram. Um, so you guys can see but it's super delicious um, and it's good for you so I think it just has um, quinoa tomatoes cucumber and it looks like it has um, oh here what does it have quinoa uh, mung beans cucumber tomatoes vegetable oil bell peppers parsley lentils concentrated lemon juice salt vinegar chives water sugar spices and contains wheat um, so yeah it's really good um, and you don't even have to put like um, chicken or anything on the side like I just took this like a nice Tupperware full of this it was filling it was good um, and with my water because it made me really thirsty too so I like things that make me really thirsty because um, that's when I'll start drinking a lot of water um, and again this was for this huge thing and it's like they pack it up um, it's $9.99 you guys can see it right there $9.99 um, so it was really good. It wasn't expensive at all, um, and it fills you up, and it um, it's good for a couple meals. It's not like you're buying ten bucks, and it's just one meal. Like, hello, um, McDonald's for a meal, it's like six bucks or whatever, and that's just 
one meal and you're done. Um, but with this, you have a couple um, times you can take it to lunch or for dinner. So those are kind of some things I want to share with you that I got. Um, so definitely I am right back into this weight loss. No more BS, no more playing around with all this um, junk food because it's not good for me and it's pissing me off and I don't like it and it's affecting everything around me as well. So um, keep going you guys. I'm going to follow you. Make sure you keep looking at some of more of my videos. I'm going to be posting another one. What's today? Friday. I'll post one on Sunday um, just to kind of like a kickstart to the week um, and we'll go from there and then I'll keep updating you guys on my results. Quickly I want to say so if you haven't seen my last video watch it because previous videos I was at 199. This is hard to say because I screwed myself over but I am at 210 now um, and that was what guys through a couple weeks that's how much weight I gained so do not go for the junk food do not eat that crap um, because it's harder to lose weight it's super easy to gain it back um, so make sure you're not going for that junk food because that's what happened and I know I'm probably disappointing some of you and some of you are probably like oh what the hell you you try to motivate us and you're screwing up well yeah you know what I screwed up um, but that's why I'm sharing it with you guys, so you guys don't screw up. Um, so yeah, I'm at 210. That was really hard to say. I didn't know if I was going to share that with you guys. But since I said I'm going to be transparent, there you go. There you have it. 10 pounds I have to restart to lose. Um, and it sucks. So I will update you guys on my progress. Um, but thanks for watching. Watching. Thanks for your support. Um, and hopefully I still have most of your support. Um, and motivation because all I want through these videos is to kind of motivate you guys and keep you guys on track and um, let you guys know that you're not alone so if there's anyone that has given up I haven't mentioned this there are people out there that are watching my videos and you guys gave up um, don't worry it happens do not worry don't kill yourself over it don't don't think you can't restart or you're a failure because you know what, yes, those are the feelings that I feel, but you can start again. Um, that's, that's the beauty of finally doing it for yourself, is you are your hardest critic, you are going to be disappointed in yourself, but that's why you have to push yourself. Um, so make sure you do, and um, I will follow you guys, and just leave me some comments if there's anything else you want to know, or any other tip you want to, um, me to share with you guys, um, let me know, and I will. All right, bye, and Coco's been bugging me, so I thought I'd show you him, because he's in my picture anyways. Hi, right, Coco, say hi. Say hi, buddy. Hi, look, up here, look. <gasps> yeah. Okay, <laughs> bye, guys.